What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Buzz Don Zay back again with another beggar, man. As y'all can see by the title, bro, we reacted to that Kansas State versus um Colorado Buffaloes, man. As y'all know, Kansas State is probably the first unranked team they, I mean, first ranked team. I'm sorry about that, ranked team that they played. So we are gonna see how them boys coming. You know, I'm hoping that Colorado win, just cause you know what I'm saying. I just I'm on a Colorado hype train. I ain't gonna lie, I ain't no bandwagon, but I like what them boys been doing. You feel me? And we gonna see what they coming. Y'all like coming and subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Your boy on the road to one mil. Let's do it, man. Jimmy Horn watches it go over his head. They'll start first and ten from their own 25-yard line. That's where Shadur Sanders will take the range of this Colorado offense. Folks, not let him beat them with his legs. He passes it on first down in a tight window, complete for the first down in a couple of weeks after suffering that broken wrist. Here's Johnson, almost sacked. He throws it away. Oh, yeah, that line. The boy finally playing now. You feel me? You know, they D line one on nothing, but them boys seem like they came to play. Hey, we might have a grounding. Did not appear to cross the line of scrimmage. McCoy was pressuring along with Silman Craig. Versions. This year, Hunter is split to the top of your screen. Sanders has time, finds his man, and the lunge for the first down by Wester. The offensive line, that last one was on Shadur. Third and eight, gets it out wide open, nothing but real estate in front of Wester. Got a block out there, hey. Wester. Did y'all see that? My boy followed that block. Open, nothing but Look at my boy Travis, Travis Hunter. Direct and Real estate in front of what? Right way. Wester got right a block. Hmm. Got there, Wester. Come on, man, that's too easy. And as I see that boy Webster, um, Shadur, they connected different. Like that's one of his guys. Like he he got a set. Like he really know his team. Like he got a real like game plan of who I'ma hit, who gonna get a good get good bit of targets tonight. You know what I'm saying? Like he come in with that already knowing, like with that game plan already knowing who he going to. Touchdown, Buffaloes. Blocked by Hunter on this play, Roddy. Well, they turn him, they turn Lejante Wester completely free, and then Travis Hunter just gets in the way a couple times, and that's all you need to do in the offensive lines. Jace Brown in motion, their second leading receiver. Johnson rolls out, hits Edwards in the flat. Nice move by Dylan Edwards. Tiptoes out of bounds right around that first. Out of their <laughs> I like that. That boy Dylan popping his junk. Like, yeah, y'all cut me. I mean, he's like, yeah, y'all weren't playing me. I bet. Hold that. Really excited. Let's see if he scored this game. About him, but coming back home, closer to home at Kansas. Giddens right between the tackles. They gash that front, and Giddens makes it down to the 41-yard line. Giddens picks up the first down, and then some still on his feet. Oh, what a shake in the open field! Hey, that boy's shifty though. That boy's shifty. And inside the 15 at the 14, Hunter making the tackle. Under the lights here in Boulder, that's quarterback Avery Johnson of Kansas State being sacked by the Colorado defensive front led by B.J. Green. They're going to go for it on fourth down. Blitz off the edge. Johnson eludes the rush. Falls. Now, how y'all let that happen? Fourth down, chance to get off the field. And y'all literally let the quarterback run it in. Touchdown, Wildcats! And he, and he dancing. Does the Deion Sanders dance? So disrespectful. That Hey, I ain't gonna lie. If I'm Shadur, Shiloh, fuck it, even Travis at this point. We scrapping. Ain't no way you're doing Deion Dan's like that on me. Not after you just scored on me. I ain't taking that disrespect personally, but. Now, Roddy, you can play everything well, but with Avery Johnson at quarterback, it's always the danger of him taking off. And does he get in the end zone before that leg's down? He does extend before the knee hits the ground. The question, does he break the plane of the goal line? Ooh. This is the call, Any Bill. Any part of the ball in possession you, breaks. Julian Littlefield, the touchdown stands. I'm actually surprised they didn't confirm the call. 
Trying to hook a big fish tonight in a ranked opponent. Sanders picks up a good block and gets down safely at about the 36-yard line. Yeah, they were running over Jordan Seaton, their best offensive lineman, the freshman All-American candidate. Putting on fourth and one. You don't trust your personnel, Dion. Shadur. End over end punt. Oh, uh, what a job. It's going to be down. A good punt, though. Inside the two-yard line. These two teams meet again, and the winner's going to get a bye in the college football playoff. Avery Johnson hands it off to Giddens. What a move. Oh, he's on the loose. And brought down at about the 30-yard line. Giddens at 215 pounds in the secondary. The, the two-play, the tackle in the H-back seal this for DJ Giddens and create a lane. But him and he, DJ Giddens in the open field has been tremendous. He's got a great jab step, one-on-one -on -one with Shiloh. Second down and 10. Giddens again absorbed the big hit, stayed on his feet. Relentless, ruthless running. Sacked back at the 37. The third one of the evening. Silman Craig, a beacon on that defense for the Buffaloes. Team and owner of the Raiders, Mr. Davis. And Shadur is about just winning. At pa First down and 10. Sanders to the wide side of the field. That's Hunter. And they bottle him up at about the 35. Keenan Garber. Not to mention the work he does on defense. Sanders going to pass again. Steps up into the pocket. Finds his man. Caught and hit immediately at the 48-yard line. That was Hunter again. Like and Travis Hunter. Looks like he's going to head into the Buffalo's locker room. See, bro, you just finna know what, well, you just know what type of game this finna be. When Travis gets hurt, it's always different. That literally changes the whole trajectory of everything. Every time Travis gets hurt, bro. And I understand that boy do put a lot of wear and tear on his body. But sometimes you got to, like, know when to limit it, bro, because they going to need you, bro. This game, they going to need you for sure. And the rest of the season, they're going to need you. So you cannot be hurt. Like, if you Travis Hunter, you got to always be, nigga, healthy, nigga, for real. Because As we go quickly down to Q. Yeah, Hunter, with that right shoulder pain, Mark, that you pointed out. Look at that. He only missed one snap, y'all. Like, that's not sustainable. Out, the medical staff looked at him. He came over grimacing in pain. They came over to him again. And now this is the second time in this game. That and you know that hurt him to go, you know what I'm saying, out. Because, you know, he don't be trying to get uh, even take a break or none and he has walked off and i i went on um social media and i found out i was trending because of another guy that has my same name and he johnson the kansas state quarterback i thought something was going on with my giddens again tackled right at that first down marker to see the headliners Edwards broke a couple of tackles, still on his feet, miraculously makes it down to the one-yard line. The diminutive but dynamic tailback with Kansas State. Out of Wichita, Kansas. Hands it off, and Edwards completes what he started. Yeah, I know that boy lit. That boy said this is his revenge game, boy. I'm already doing it, nigga. Yeah. I know how he feeling, bro. I know how that boy Edwards feeling, man. I ain't gonna lie. Had to get him a tutty. The Wildcats take the lead. Lifting from there. I mean, the entire left side of this offensive line just caves everything down. And the tight end, Will Ancio, really seals the deal. Creates a big surge. Collapses the defensive line. Dylan Edwards makes a man miss. And he's in all his firing. Nathaniel Hackett's demotion from play caller. Shador Sanders to pass. Has a clean pocket underneath. Comes to his transfer from Vandy. Shepard broke a couple of tackles out near midfield at the 47-yard line. Colin not on the field on this down. Shadur Sanders pulls wide open at the 35. Caught by another one of those lethal threats. Omarion Miller with the catch. Last year has been at his best in two-minute drills, Roddy. Eludes the rush and then sacked. 
back at the 50-yard line. Purnell there first, but able to walk off the field under his own power. Avery Johnson taking a shot, has a man. That's their second leading receiver, Jace Brown. Brought down by Shiloh Sanders, and now Jace Brown on third and seven. Caught for the first down and then some. Brown down to the 11-yard line. First and 10, Wildcats. Brown. Go Bears! Go Wolves! With Fairlife Ultra Filtered Milk, you'll want to savor every moment. Sorry about the ads again, y'all. Um, if y'all want to donate to my Patreon, uh, we won't have to watch ads no more. You know, we still in the trenches. Robinson hands it off to Giddens. The DJ spinning within the shadow of the end zone. Picks up the first down. But no signal yet for a touchdown. Under further review, went on the field. Wow. Just give him the touchdown. There's a touchdown. Let's bring in Bill Lamagne to take a look at this touchdown run. It was called a touchdown on the field. Seemed to be yeah, some indecision by the officials making the call. The official at the top of the screen came in, marking it a bit short. And this is going to show you he is short. The yeah. knee's down. Yeah, yeah, his knee was down. It's not in. Shouldn't Brown breaks the plane or not. Touchdown. The Wildcats put it in the end zone. Pardon me in their line. Bro said, cut this shit out. It was not going for that. Last game and scores another one here. Question is. It would have been a touchdown anyways, though, because he had the ball already put a plane. When it came loose for a Tremendous job to. Shadour gets it out quickly. Complete. What a move by Shepard. Oh, he hit him with the soft. Good move. It's all the way out to midfield. And a Sanders pulls it out. On the slant complete down to the 35. Same guy. The Remax scoring run. After trailing 7 to nothing. Sanders on the receiver screen complete. Got a wave of blockers down to the 21 yard line. That's Omarion Miller. Making a nice play. You wonder if Shador Sanders might go after one of the new DBs that came in. Gets it off wide open. Shepard. Oh, Shepard, bro. Shepard. Why does this man always drop the clutch catches? Like, my nigga, what's going on with your hands, bro? What's going on with your hands, Will Shepard? Like, I'm really concerned for this guy, bro. This is the second time he dropped a real crucial catch, bro, this season that I've seen, bro. My nigga need to get them checked out or something because this is crazy. Every time, you selling yourself off the seven. I mean, off the six, whatever, nigga, you selling yourself. Dropped it. It ain't nobody fuck but yours. That is the second deleterious drop that he's had. He... My nigga said, my, you got niggas saying words I never heard off your catching. Come on, bro. The untimely drops. Oh, wow. How you drop that? Like, it's not like you had a high point. You just had to catch it. Like, Felt like he was setting up his next move before he reeled the ball in the game. They come with a blitz this time. Sanders, what a catch. Open is Miller. And pushed out of bounds at about the seven-yard line. Sanders pulls. And he still trusts you, still go to you. I knew Will Shepard was going to have a breakout game, though. I knew he was. Touchdown, Shepard. Atonement. At the end of the Baylor game, said he came to the sideline and told Coach Prime, I'm back in the UCF game. And you know what Coach Prime told him? You never left, baby. You never left. Career high, 207. No Travis Hunter in on defense. Giddens, man, that must be jelly because Jam doesn't shake like that. What a move. He left a defender defenseless. Chris Tennant from. Wait, let's go back and see that move because.
That boy never left. I ain't gonna okay, He's a real running back. I ain't gonna lie. That boy nice. I never. I ain't gonna say I didn't know about him, but like, I didn't know too much about him. I didn't know he was this good. He's good. Two oh seven. No Travis Hunter in on defense. <sighs> oh my God. Pick your man. You never oh, left. The, Career high bro. 207. No bro. Travis Hunter in on defense. Bro, I think that's uh Shallow, bro. Oh my God, bro. Rest in peace to this man's ankles, bro. Jesus Christ, bro. That man ankles went to heaven, bro. This is crazy. I ain't gonna cap that nah, bro. We scrapping after that, bro. You not finna break me like that, bro. And just think that that's okay, bro. I ain't gonna lie, fool. That's crazy. I, bro, that's crazy, bro. Bad work, bro. Defense Giddens. Man, that must be jelly because Jam doesn't shake like that. What a move. He left a defender defenseless. Chris Tennant from 48 yards out. No doubt. Drills it. Amazon fall favorites are here. They've been able to keep Shadour upright, though, here in the third quarter. Steps up and sacked again. They have been in his chest like bronchitis. I mean, so Westbrook of the Denver Nuggets. Watching on the sideline, Shadour Sanders on first and ten. Drills a rope complete to Omarion Miller. Out to the 46-yard line and a first down for Sanders and his offense. Eight. But Shador tried to bail and it ended up in another catastrophic sack. That's the sixth one of the game downfield. Miller with the catch and a first. By Miller, he, hey Miller, he, he, he official, bro. I ain't gonna cap from him. I'm transferring. I don't know how many years he got left eligibility. If I'm him, I'm transferring. I'm not gonna lie. I'm transferring because you know Shador gone. You know Travis gone. Coach Prime gonna be there, but we don't know who their quarterback finna be after him. I'm leaving, bro. I ain't gonna cap that boy. is nice. He has good potential. First down at the 20 yard line. Omarion. And he's slow to get up. <laughs> Sanders gets it out over the middle, overthrows him, and right into the arms of the safety for the interception. Come on, bro. Shadir, what are you doing, kid? Like, bro, what was you thinking, bro? What was, what was going on right here, bro? Like, he just really just did some stupid stuff. Like, my nigga. Sanders gets it out over the middle. Who was you throwing it to? My nigga? Did you think this nigga had on a black jersey or something? What did you see? Because I'm confused, gang. You overthrew the hell out of him. Threw it straight to him, bro. My nigga. He could have literally went to go get lunch, come back, and the pick still would have been there on the way to him. Come on, fam. Throws him and right into the arms of the safety for the interception. Payne brings it out to the 25. Anders, who because of the pressure at his feet, just overthrows this. Mm. It's just a miss. It's, it's one of the few misses that we've seen during this game by Shador, but... They go empty formation. Avery Johnson pulls to Giddens. Met immediately at about the 32. By Roddy for the baseball team. Mm. Punter, punt returner. World War II, his boat was attacked by a kamikaze uh, late in, in, the Pacific, uh, in the Pacific battle. Harden got the start. George Sanders back to pass under duress again. Steps up into the pocket, tucks it under. And gets down safely, finally, in the slot. A motion out of the backfield. Sanders with time. Got to deliver. Does. And finds his man, Wester, for the first down. They stay alive. The progression there. Yeah, it's really good protection and a good movement in the pocket to eventually let Wester come free. On first and ten, clean pocket. A bullet. Inside the 10 to Miller this time. It's going to be first and goal, Buffaloes. A rare sight. <laughs> Little 12 personnel. They're going to ride it into the end zone. Touchdown, Augustov. They've done it on the ground tonight. You see the graphic. Johnson to pass. 
complete. Brown with room out near midfield. And he moves the chains with the first down catch and run. The fact that he's built for moments like these. They come out in an empty formation. Gets out of it in time. Gets the ball out. Catch and run by the tight end, Garrett Oakley. And another Wildcat first down, silencing the crowd here in Boulder. Pressure on Johnson, incomplete. So the Buffaloes will get off the field. Johnson almost picked off it is. Mm. Jumped and picked off. Hood. Colton Hood. Stun. <laughs> Bro, I go cap. He was supposed to score right there. I go. <laughs> Like, bro, this man's got shot mid-round or something, bro. Like, my nigga, bro. <laughs> Hood! <laughs> Colton Hood! <laughs> that boy got them heavy feet. Like, bro, come on, okay? He was supposed to score, bro. This is like Daniel Jones play, bro. Like, come on, man. This nigga tackled his soul. Fumbles and falls! When I'm hit, I always get up. Injured Travis Hunter and a friendly carom here, Roddy. It's it's a forced bad throw because of the pressure. And then Colton Hood does the hard part. He makes everybody miss. <laughs> and it's him in the open field. Preston Hodges' foot may have gotten in the way. But the uh, don't blame nobody else. That was on bro. The pressure by Robert Livingston, the fading by Avery Johnson, the tip, and Colton Hood is Johnny on the spot and almost went it with a bunch of guys. It wouldn't have started. Second and four. Sanders, quick release, complete. They go ahead. Webster. Hey, Webster him. Man-to-man -man coverage, and the question has been, can you cover these players in man-to-man? -man? It's a nice throw by Shador Sanders putting it Too nasty. right between the one and the zero. And LaJonte Wester does the rest against Daniel Cobbs, one of the reserve defensive backs in the game because of the injuries that they've suffered. And he is fired up knowing <laughs> that he just put his team ahead by four. Can't they fake the jet sweep. Wide open out of the backfield. Giddens with tons of real estate. Shiloh Sanders helps run him down and pushes him out of bounds at about the 45-yard line. What a play fake that time by Avery Johnson. Pass interference. Defense number 24. That finishes the crime. He wrote the play. Throws in its incredible poise and precision from Jace Brown. Watch how he stacks the defensive back. He puts his back right in front of the chest, so all Preston Hodge can do is go through his back. To That's crazy. I ain't gonna lie. That's wow. Try and get the football. It ends up in the pass interference for more than that. Third and 11 as a result. Sanders comes underneath, complete at the 30-yard line. Hayden makes the catch. Picks up six, so we're looking at fourth down and about five to go for the ball game. He better go Brady Moe. Game. We got to get to the 35. Pressure off the edge. Sanders downfield. Incomplete. No flag on the play intended for Shepard. Garber was there. I don't know, bro. I don't know, bro. I don't know, bro. Pressure off the edge. Sanders downfield. I don't know, bro. I don't know. Bro. I don't know, bro. I don't know. Like, I don't know, bro. That, that's, that's questionable. That's questionable. That's questionable. Sanders is questionable. Downfield. Because he did get his head around oh, last minute, but like. He grabbing him, though. He grabbing him. Incomplete. Though. 
No flag on the play. I think that's a flag, bro, personally. That's just my take. But yeah, with that being said, but y'all like coming to subscribe. We on the road to one million. Let's do it.